Hi you guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Lana for T Perkins. And for today's video, I wanted to talk about that, you know, where like male dominance and stuff like that and how males are always this like dominant sex that tries to dominate, you know, females and stuff. I don't understand that. You know, like men will get insecure when they see a woman like doing goals and dreams and stuff like that without a man. You know, you know, and they be like, you know, like, why not? You know, why are you not with me? You know, or why? You know, like, why don't you see me as a value to be a partner in your journey, in your life? You know? And I just wanted to basically talk about it, you know? So I don't really get it, you know? I don't understand it, you know? I never understand it. You know, I was more of like, when I was young, I was a tomboy, you know, growing up and stuff like that. And, you know, like if you guys follow my channel, you guys know that, you know, that I just, I was more of a, I was like a tomboy type of female, you know? Um, I started becoming girly girl when I got like older, but you know, I was a girly girl, it's just, I was more tomboyish, you know, but yeah, you know, but still, you know, but even then, you know, like I was always, like I told you guys, like I fought men, you know, I didn't fight females, I was fighting men growing up, not females growing up, you know, men, you know, big men, you know, not small men, like big, skinny bigger, wider men, you know, not just one size. Men that are just, you know, arms are fully developed, you know, this is my arm length, you know, I'm skinny, you know, I'm like, I'm small, you see, but don't let this, like, you know, like, my size doesn't really matter, you know, to me as I view it, you know, because, yeah, I'm skinny, I have my limitations, but, you know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, a fist is a fist. You know what I'm saying? A fist is a fist. So, you know, but yeah. And I just don't understand that whole idea of perceive a male dominance towards a female partner, you know, as like, you know, because there's some men that will hit women. You know, there's some men that just don't like women. You know, they don't like the idea of a woman telling them what to do. You see that a lot of the time in a working environment too, a lot too. Not like that definement, but sometimes, you know, like in even the working world, you know, like sometimes the man doesn't like to take orders from the female boss, you know, like, but he still does, yes. But, you know, sometimes, you know, they just don't like it. You know, they don't like the idea of, a woman telling them what to do and telling them orders and telling them what they should do, you know, and, you know, it just, I don't understand it, but even if the woman is like, you know, very knowledgeable and stuff in that nature, they just want to, you know, they want to find out for themselves. And I get it, like, it's the curiosity of men have, yeah, they want to find out the leap for themselves, but, you know, but still you know it's like you know like dominating you know it's just i guess you know I, that's what i just don't really understand it's just you know i'm trying to give you guys like the most like a best video because that's my goal of course is to give you guys the best video but i just i really just don't seem to understand of the idea of male dominance you know like you know as well i'm you know a male, so I have to be dominant. I don't understand that. You know, it's like, I don't understand that. You know, it's not like the end of the world. You know, when like a female tries to make demands upon a male of what should do and what they should not do, you know, um, you know, it just doesn't really make sense to me. Yeah. You know, like if your advice is unattended and, you know, it's not needed, then yeah, you know, then of course, you know, but sometimes, you know, it's just, you know, part of, you know, me and women, like, you know, we sometimes just have to share our voice because we want our voice to be heard, you know, and that's just the way it goes, you know, because that's just the way it is, you know, we want our voice to be heard, you know, so, you know, so yeah, but I just really don't understand why, like, 
men view dominance as like an overall category like I have to dominate I have to dominate life. I have to dominate my finances. I have to dominate my relationship. I have to dominate my family like relationships. I have to dominate my family structure. It's just like, dang. You know, like all this dominance of what you're doing. Can you keep up with all this dominance that you're trying to do? Like, I gotta dominate this, dominate that, dominate this, dominate that person, dominate this person. And I know what I'm saying. And then when they find the person that they can't dominate, you know, it's kind of like a big overwhelming feeling for them. Like, why can't I not dominate you? Oh, it's because there must be, like, there's something else then. Because I can't dominate you. You know, it's like, you know, and I'll be like, yeah, you know, like that little domination, manipulation type techniques that men try to pull on women. That shit doesn't, excuse my language, but that shit just keeping it real. That shit just doesn't, it doesn't, it just doesn't fly. You know, it's like, it's like it's uncalled for. You know, it's like you want to dominate me, but you don't understand the part of being dominate means. You know, like, do you know every category of being dominant? You know, like, do you actually know? So, you know, like, that also goes into the part of submissiveness, you know, of, but that's a whole nother video. But yeah, you know, but I don't understand that, you know, like, you know, because as a female, I'm dominant, you know, and my name's on Nefertiti, and, you know, like, you know, so, you know, it's like I'm dominant, you know, meaning I like leadership roles, I like growing in my own journey, you know, like, I like to branch into my own territory of things and do my own thing, you know, without a male subordinate, you know, like a male, like basically a subordinate, you know? So, you know, and yeah, I know I told you guys, like, you know, I'm married and stuff like that. And it was something to get used to and something to learn curve for like the dominant structure of, you know, letting my man just take some dominant leap into the relationship and I take the submissive leap, but not all the time. I like to take the submissive leap, meaning there's a lot of things I like to get my hands dirty in and get my hands clean in, basically. You know, so, you know, because I'm a more of a hands-on type, you know, so, you know, so, yeah. But I just don't understand. You know, I never really truly did it. Maybe some of my audience who are males, you know, can tell me why male dominance is so a big deal to males you know because at this moment as a, like my standpoint of it I'm just like I don't understand it you know I just like you know like you know like part of me like, I just don't understand it like overall just it's just there's just too much to get into and it's like in one video you know it's just so much you know because I just I just don't understand it so yeah but this has been for today's video. Um, please, if you're a male and you're watching this video, comment and tell me why males believe that dominance is the key in their life to everything. You know, maybe it's because they're men. Maybe it's because there's some other things that goes on into their environment where they feel they have to dominate everything. So, you know... But um, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video.